It's post time for the 12th and final. Field is moving in behind the home hardware building center starting gate. Twelfth and uh, final race on today's program has Kingston Sealster, Mighty Mouse, Nay Monster, NS Acadian, Preceptor, At the Helm, and Black Electra. They are off. Mighty Mouse away quickly. We'll grab the early lead as they race into the first turn. Up on the outside, that's Black Electra. Charging up second on the inside, uh, Nay Monster takes a tuck third, away fourth is Kingston Sealster. Outside and racing in five as they continue on by the opening eighth and into the back stretch is at a Cicadian. Then back to Preceptor and at the back of the field, that's at the helm. They continue past the opening quarter and Block Electra is showing the way out there by two. With Mighty Mouse in pursuit second, tied up in the three spot, that's Nay Monster. Looking at it from four in the early going is Kingston Sealster. Advancing outside uncovered from five is at a Cicadian. Then Preceptor has only one beaten at this stage. That is at the helm as they continue past the three eights and off the turn. 29 and two was the quarter. They continue into the stretch now as they near the half. Black Electra is still the boss out there by two as they approach the half with Mighty Mouse getting the trip in the pocket. Second outside now moving up to third is on a Cicadian. Inside fourth for Nate Monster. Fifth along the rail. That's Kingston Sealster. Now on the move on the outside is Preceptor in six. And uh, at the helm is tipping to the outside from seven. They were past the half in a minute and four fifth seconds on their way through the back stretch now for the final time. And they're still led by Black Electra. On the inside, Mighty Mouse content to follow along in the pocket outside. And trying it first up, that's Anna Cicadian in a three. There's Preceptor sent three high from four inside. And with nowhere to go, Nay Monster is traveling fifth. They race past three quarters. It's Black Electra and Mighty Mouse. They sit one, two. Now re-emerging third is Nay Monster as they race on over to the 7-H Black Electra. Mighty Mouse now angling out of the pocket as they continue past the 7 eights and off the top turn. One thirty-two and four, three quarters. And Mighty Mouse moves on to take over the lead as they straighten out for the payoff. Back second is Black Electra, but Mighty Mouse on the outside, and Mighty Mouse will win the finale. Second, that is Black Electra, and third is Nay Monster. Mile in 202 and one fifth. All right, the finale goes to Mighty Mouse. And uh, yeah, we've chased her for a long time in Churro, and today it pays off. Uh, she wins as a heavy favorite, uh, reuniting with Red Doucette. That's a few wins now for Mighty Mouse in uh, recent uh, goes. Uh, Inverness victory late September, the amateur victory for Chris Coben last week, and now Red Doucette aboard Mighty Mouse for the victory. Number eight, Black Electra. Well, the racing luck, she had it today. She's had poor racing luck in recent starts. I figured she'd show some gate speed, and I figured she'd be second best at, at a price, and she was. A uh, nice trip there for the Won't Back Down Stable and Black Electra. Darren Crow on board for the deuce. And then number three, Name Monster finishing fourth. Two, eight, five, and three. I just checked the HPI, hpi.com. Uh, the winning exactor payoff uh, looks like it's going to pay about $46, and that's a great price on those two. Mighty, ha Mighty Mouse over Black Electra and Name Monster. Again, a 2, 8, 3, and 5, top 4, and it's unofficial.
Now back, the 12th race winner, number two, Body Mouse, 10 year old mare by Million Dollar Cam, over the CC stables of Middle Sackville. Trained by Chris Coven, Redmond Doucette picking up his second win of the afternoon, Mighty Mouse, 202 and 1 fifth.